In the previous video we have known about NFT games. An NFT game combines conventional gaming designs with unconventional game mechanisms to let users have more control over in-game assets like skins, characters, weapons, virtual lands and much more. This is made possible by launching games on blockchain and anchoring them with digital asset-powered economies. In today's video we'll discuss one important update that's about NFT Game Warriors of Eridina. Hey crypto lovers this is Crypto Billionaire, your friendly neighborhood crypto and financial education channel. No wandering crypto billionaire YouTube channel takes guarantee of losses incurred. While investing as we do not provide financial advice and crypto markets high risk markets, the sole purpose of the information posted on the YouTube channel is for education only. And now to introduce the topic with that being said, let's begin. The Warriors of Eridina NFT game is on the move to modernize the medieval fantasy sector. Starting the community can purchase the 8000 NFT Warriors populating its play to earn and metaverse ecosystem. The Warriors of Eridina NFT Drop The NFT Drop features 8000 Warriors created from over 200 different handcrafted features and attributes with over 24 billion unique combinations. The artist behind the characters is a Royal Academy of Arts nominee. Warriors of Eridina NFTs The project's battle cry is to create community wealth and reward early adopters. Co-founder Bacon Boy tweeted that, a wealthy community equals a happy community. He announced that, the team decided to reduce the original mint price of 0.06 Ethereum to 0.045 Ethereum. Furthermore, they also reduced the total supply from 10,000 to 8,000 to increase scarcity and value. The NFTs will be available for purchase on the website through an initial sale by clicking the Mint a Warrior button. For every purchase, the project will mint a randomly selected warrior and deliver it to the player's wallet and OpenSea account. Moreover, in order to ensure fair distribution, there is a maximum limit of 15 warriors per transaction. Exploring the gameplay. The gameplay for the warriors of Eridina NFTs revolves around three aspects, the arena, battlegrounds and the tavern. Every warrior has unique attribute ratings assigned for attack, defense, agility, and intelligence. It is based on the combination of features in its NFT embodiment. These attributes powers the play to earn battle gaming system titled, The Arena. Winners will be rewarded with power, erotonine gold and NFT airdrops. On the other hand, losers must fall back in line. The next aspect of the game is, the battlegrounds. Each warrior owner will be airdropped, a piece of land within the kingdom of Eridina at no extra cost once all warriors are minted. Owning two pieces of adjacent land will allow the warrior NFTs to create a faction. So more land translates to more members joining the player's faction. In effect, players will wage wars with other factions to conquer more land and claim stake as the new rules of the metaverse world. Warriors of Eridina Roadmap The Kingdom of Eridina is a long-term project creating a medieval fantasy metaverse with play to earn gaming. In essence, the community drives the development of the gameplay. So, through Discord, members can propose their ideas and feedback. According to the website, the project will roll out key milestones as players buy more Warriors of Eridina NFTs. So after minting 25% NFTs, the liquidity pool will be initiated while the 50% milestone is the arena. Then, the 75% mark will kickstart the play to earn component of the project. Finally, hitting 100% will unlock the battlegrounds. This will be a historic moment, as Cedify and WOA team will be pioneering the bridging between an NFT avatar drop and their play to earn game incubation. Holders of the Warriors of Eridina, Genesis, NFT avatar set, will be getting in-game benefits. Cedify Fund will be incubating WOA's turn-based play to earn miniature strategy game, supporting it to become a widely adopted game through many aspects such as game design, marketing, partnerships, gamification, strategic advisory, and exclusively holding the fundraising rounds of their in-game token at Cedify Fund. Blockchain Gaming Launchpad open to SFUND holders. 
drawing inspiration from tabletop miniature games like Warhammer and video games. Similar to Heroes of Might and Magic, Woe's game is going to be a completely new take on the tabletop genre. With 3D miniatures, engaging skill and strategy-based gameplay, for those who want to not only compete and rise through the ranks, but to dominate to earn more. What is more, today we will be releasing a viral campaign to reward Genesis Warriors of Eridina NFT avatars from the upcoming set to 50 lucky winners who participate in the lottery. Let's now explore the medieval fantasy theme. Play to earn 3D miniature game Cetify is incubating with the WOA team. Let us know your thoughts about NFT games down in the comments. Which NFT game you have played before? Let's go! Battle Arena The Warriors of Eridina Battle Arena is the first play to earn game in the medieval kingdom of Eridina universe. It will feature a turn-based, 3D miniatures, strategy platform, in which the objective is to defeat your opponent in battle by reducing their commanding warrior's health to zero. The first game board will be a 6x6 checkered layout, but board sizes will vary with new, additional game modes. Each player starts by browsing their units, and actions collection in their barracks, and building their army. When the optimal strategy options have been chosen, players will engage in PvP combat in the arena, with the winner of each battle being rewarded with loot chests that contain a Rodanine gold, the game's currency, other prizes, and random NFT arena playing collectibles, APCs. APCs can be used to improve a player's army, allowing for the implementation of a vast number of strategies or traded with other players. One commanding warrior must be selected, which operates as a unit with enhanced attributes, but also acting as the player's game help, so strategizing carefully is imperative. Initially, only the Genesis Warriors of Eridina will be able to be chosen as commanding warriors, but as the number of players grows, a training system will be implemented, allowing for the creation of subsequent generations of warriors, while rewarding the Genesis players. Units will share the same attributes as warriors, each having individual values of attack, defense, magic, agility, intelligence modifying the damage dealt, and received, their movement around the board and critical hit rate. Battles are not won by soldiers alone. A true commander must use their environment to their advantage and employ strategies that surprise their opponent. Special actions, SAS, allow players to do just this and have the potential to turn the tide of battle. Special actions will make up a smaller proportion of a player's army and will be far rarer in loot chests. With each unit boasting a wide variety of attributes affecting their movement, range, damage, and health. Special actions changing the battle conditions and environment, and unique arena boards. Only the most talented and committed strategists will be able to prevail. You can join the WOA Discord channel, and follow them on Twitter. To get every update about crypto don't forget to subscribe. Also turn the notification bell on.